Everything was fine before Boss Burton came to Jenkins. Stories have been said that he travels from town to town, excavating the land, looking for the wealth. It never was said why the boss came to our town that fateful year. Some say it was his lust for the precious rock. <laughs> or maybe he knew that the people of this town would fold under his unruly power. But one man took a stand against the boss's tyranny. Joe attempted to rally the people of Jenkins against Boss Burton, but caused nothing but pain and strife for themselves. Joe knew he had to leave if only to prevent any more trouble for the town. Don't you know what'll happen if you leave town? Mary, if I stay in Jenkins and he finds out you're my girl, he's gonna do something horrible to you. You can't trust that man. Mary, promise me you'll never listen to him. The best thing you can do right now is forget that our lips ever met, that I ever held you in my arms, or that I ever said I loved you. I don't care. If you let him take over the town and let them drill the mines, folks won't have a place to live. No one in Jenkins will have a home. Mary, folks are going to get hurt if I don't leave. I'm going to do what I have to. Joe! Mistakes were made. Mary, I'm here to right my wrongs. Word spread of Mary's murder. Joe didn't expect what he found when he returned to Jenkins. The town was on the verge of destruction. The boss had his plans to dig the mines and he wouldn't let anyone get in his way, even if he had to get his hands dirty. You came back for the wrong reason. Revenge isn't as sweet as they say it is. You think I came back for you? I came back for Mary, for Jenkins. Killing you is for my own pleasure. You think you can stop me? Must be a crazy man. Well, if that's what you think, well, prove me wrong and show up tomorrow at the old shipping trail, tomorrow at noon. Hope you've written out your will, boy. So you think you can kill me, boy? Ain't nothing gonna bring her back. I'm not here to bring Mary back, just to get even. Killing you will save Jacobs from being destroyed, as well as giving me the pleasure of knowing Mary's death meant something. Some things don't always work out the way you want. Mistakes were made. The story needs to be told and the names need to live on. Who said I'd let anyone live? you in my arms. But I ever said I loved you. No, I can have a home. Never met. 
Listen, I'm the audio guy, and I'm close up to these people, and I can realize that Dan has never been on a date in his life. And this is getting awkward, and I do not like it. It's like this. Have I ever held you in my arms? Have I ever said, I loved you? Yes. <laughs> as well as giving me the pleasure of knowing Mary's death meant something.